It's crime at Casa de Keanu part two. And this time, it's personal, man. As was part one, cause he's got some dedicated fans. So for the second time in two days, two days Keanu had a, another um, mentally person uh, come in his house. <laughs> a mentally person? Did they use mental powers to break in? Pool. <laughs> he not talk words good. But yes, another intruder creeped into Keanu's crib. Two intruders in two days. A lady got in through, got in through his gate, walked into his house, took a sh took off her clothes, took a shower in his bathroom, then decided to go for a swim. Two days in a row, two different people. Yes, and because Keanu wasn't home, there was no one there to stop her except an entire cleaning crew. They watched this woman come in, and it's like somebody might want to say, excuse me, who are you? Eventually, the crack cleaning crew called Keanu, who called 911. So how does Johnny Utah feel about all this? He did an interview about the first one. He's like so calm about it. This crazy lady broke into your house. And he describes it as like, you know, I better get up and get dressed. He was naked in his bed. He's not upset by any of this. He's just like- I don't like, know that Keanu's range allows for upset. Definitely not, no. But here's a question. When did Keanu say he was naked? Did Mike make that up? He's picturing Keanu naked in his bed. <laughs> he never said naked in bed. Yes, he did. He talks all about it. Yeah, he's like naked. Covered in baby oil. With nipple clamps. It's in the report, guys. <laughs> Fantasies. Sometimes they slip out when you least expect it.